Hey, yo, let's go. Get things rolling. Um, let me do some. Let me do some tests here in a second. Make sure everything's up and running. I think we should be good. Quickly hop on. What we'll do is you here, put you here, and let me take a look at something. What point do you figure that? Yep. So I don't. Okay. So this is what we're doing today. So, I hear and saw a couple of uh, these dudes that have this podcast shouted out my game. So, I am going to, I'm going to, I'm creating a scene, all right? Just creating a little Easter egg of where, uh, of where uh, the podcast setup is, right? Now, that being said. I'm gonna have to reference this a couple of times. But well, well, we should be all good. So let me open up Blender and let's get this started, right? So I'm just gonna just be making this setup and doing whatever. So I'm making a new project. Let's uh, let's first first and foremost let's let's make this table. So what seems like. We're gonna be doing all the materials in Unreal Engine. So let's get this wrap going. So keep it basic and simple. Let's do this. Let's make this a table. Yeah, many like it, but this one, this one's just a table. Right now, I'm gonna cut this in the corners. And I'm going to delete everything but this. Put one of the sides. And let's delete the faces. And let's, uh, mirror. Yep. Boom. So let's only do this for the table. That looks good, that looks good. So what we're gonna do... So let's bevel the side. And... Yeah. Looks about right. And let's... Um, so I'm not gonna really be worried about any UVs. I never really do. These are all going to be one solid color. The normals and textures are all kind of... Listen, that's the most... That's what I hate most about. I'm not going to cap. I mean, honestly. So, we're not... I'm not going to be really too... I'm not... It's going to be so hard to do this. And then... What we're going to do... Would it just be simple just to make a leg and to connect it? I think it will. We'll have less, uh... We'll have less polygons, so I think we'll just do that. Uh, shift to A, and let's get a... Might as well get a cylinder, right? 16, let's just do 8. 8, eight should be fine. For what we're doing, it's not anything too complicated. Cool. And <clears throat> oh shoot! Okay, now let's put this more to the side. Uh, 
Cool. Let's let's do that. And boom. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Move this up. And now we should have a decent. I mean, we might have to change proportions a little bit. I see fit. And let's just delete the faces. No one's going to see the faces, so it doesn't really matter. Does Keeping it as low poly as like humanly possible. Seems about right. Seems about right. I'm not too sure. I haven't seen this set up in person, so I could try to make it better, but uh, honestly, it... <clears throat> it's kind of... It's, it's just going to be what it is. Uh, join. Pretty, pretty straightforward, pretty simple. Let's uh, see the faces. Everything good? Okay, now let's work. Okay. Let's continue with the this piece. Now this is going to be the hard piece because we're going to need to look at indentation, right? For the metal and this is like a matte top. It looks like like a matte top to it. I'm not sh quite sure. What I'll probably do is just do this. It's, this will be a lot better in the long term, I personally think. And I will. I'm gonna have clipping. Clipping is going to be needed. Oh boy. Oh uh, shoot. Let me delete these faces. quite sure why they're like this, but I don't know. And boom. Looks relatively decent. And what we'll do. Let's, let's extrude this just a tiny bit. I just don't think the thing is just that harsh. Let me... Looks pretty decent. It looks like from the photo... Uh, it looks more harsh. Actually, yeah. Definitely is more harsh. The top is beveled. Oh, that's gonna really help, right? Uh, let me. Oh, this is just amazing. I will just this slightly smaller, and that should be fine. Is it a hard bevel? It is not a hard bevel. Right here should be good. Yep. And boom, this should be fine. Okay, now let's. Okay, let's let's color all this because that will be pretty straightforward and easy to do. Um. Highlight everything. Okay, actually, I'll make everything. Mm. Doesn't really matter, does it? Uh, this looks to be everything. So what I'm gonna do is let's set the base color as a matte black. I would do as a black, and I'm gonna make this a gray. I don't know how long the chair is going to take me to make, but 
will be relatively, relatively quick to make. It's like, look, we already have the table. This table is like pretty, pretty decent for how quickly I built it. And let's just apply. I'm not going to apply the mirror just yet, just in case we want to change anything. There we go. Now let's focus on a chair. It looks like both of them are the same chair. I can't tell. Let me, uh... For simplicity reasons, we'll make it the same chair. For simplicity reasons. Keeping it easy, keep keeping it real. Right. So, the best way to make a chair... I'm assuming it's one of the rolling chairs. That's what I'm gonna assume. Oh, gee. Okay, this is gonna be a pain in the royal arse. Let's first make the top of the chair. So I'm assuming it's flat. Oh, man, this is gonna be... This looks actually awful, but this is what we'll do. So it looks to be about right. That just tells me this is too big. Scale it down a little. I don't know. Let me continue with this. So it looks like one of those like real comfortable office chairs, but with like the gamer side handles, of, like of the side of it. So we can honestly make like a rough like setup of it. Let's edit. There's just textures and all this other crap on it, which I might have to make UVs for. I really don't want to. Might just be simpler not to. Oh, man. Okay, so what we're gonna do is... Let's just get, like, the basic foundations of it set up. Let's rotate. Um... Okay, right here. It seemed like it would be more like right here. And... Actually, yeah, it would probably be something more along the lines of like this, yeah. Let's scale it up a little bit. Boom. Pretty basic. Nothing really special. Um... Definitely downsize a little bit. Scale it down. Uh, uh, make this a little bigger too. This just seems too long. Let me push this in. Uh, seems about right. This is a, like, I want to say rough sketch, but uh, I'm not sure what we'll uh, get from it. Uh, I hate I hate doing a hard part first, but I mean second, but you know it, it, it should work. It really should. And honestly, as much as it's gonna sound stupid. Get another cube. Everything's just made with shapes, guys. Like, come on. And... For this one, though, I'm going to bring in this corner a little bit up a little. Like so. And we're going to scale it like this. Okay, that seems about right. 
Um, I'm gonna scale it down. Yeah, something like this. Yeah. Let's see, for mine, it would be like something like that. Yeah. This works. Um. Okay, it's looking good, looking good. What we need to do now. So let's have a. On the face, let's have. Let's open it up. Uh, offset, let's do individual. Uh, yeah, this would be about right. Yeah, the faces. Let's fill in the inside. Best part about this is I'm I'm gonna be able to reuse the chair and all these assets in my game. So this little like <clears throat> for them doing their shout out, I'm I'm still making assets, you know, which is good for my game, but also helps helps them out, and I really appreciate you know what they've done. Let's see here with this. Um, should I go? I would do all like heavy details at the end. Considering, let me see something real quick. We have to take a look. Um, We should get the details right too. Um, uh, still gotta. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. I don't know what the chairs look like on the bottom. So, with that being said, we are going to wing it. And one thing I know more about anything else is winging. So from here on, from like the bottom down, we're gonna wing it. See if get it to somewhat decent, decent looking. And then what we'll end up doing is, um, at the end of this, I will end up adding their Instagram. <sighs> okay. Um. Let's get to the middle of this, all right? So let's just boom, shift D. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do this, all right? Um, I might as well do this, do this, and should lower it down a little bit, or I don't think we need to. I mean, let me keep put these back on, and I will just change the size, the size of it. Let's, uh, cool, and cool, this is, this is looking pretty nice, I probably could have just used a fucking, uh, anything else, but this, this should, this should be fine, and let me raise this up just a tad bit. And raise it up. What we'll do is I'll just have a uh admittedly we'll just it really doesn't matter considering Hmm. Let me check. Huh. 
let's I'm trying to figure out how I want to do the uh I genuinely don't know how I want to do this. Meatball, let's go. Honestly, let's get a cube. Or what we could do is, um, I know it probably has wheels on it, so that's that's a something I I need to figure this out, right? I'm, I'm just going to assume it's like a little up here, the wheels part. And let's split it. Okay, let's, let's what we'll do. We'll use the same tactic as before. We're going to split it four times and we're going to delete everything that's not one side. Now, Benefit of this is gonna be, and we're gonna try to make like an X shape. It's definitely not gonna be amazing, but hmm. Do something like this might work. It, the only issue is gonna be it looks like a star. Um, smear this way. So what we can do is we can delete one of the sides. We, I mean, at least, or we can move the point. I think maybe moving the point. this way oh yeah this is looking tremendously better okay okay this is this is good and let me okay when I'm gonna I'm gonna put it like this for all intents and purposes and then once we make it one object I'll connect it together Yeah, okay. Okay, um... Let's... Yeah, let's do this. This will, this will work fine. And then we can put wheels on the bottom. I will... No, no, no! I'm determining if I really wanna. I can have. Sure. I am not sure what I want to do with this. Well, boom. I could definitely make sure the bottom completely hollow because no one would be able to see it. But part of me wants me to let this be able to move, so. Sure. Um, let's continue with this. All right. Move it up. Let's get it just a wheel. Just a normal ass wheel. Nothing special. Uh, I honestly, I was supposed to. Say, I think we can do four. Or that's just a square at that point. We'll keep with the eight. Yeah, this is. Is this still? Oh, uh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Rotate. Let's make sure it's decently perfect. Make the scale a little smaller. With, uh... <sighs> 
Let's find a and oh Jesus. Let's move it. Close enough. We don't. We don't need anything too spectacular. It's just a wheel. That probably no one's going to notice. Um, do I want this? <clears throat> Honestly, I could. I could connect it. But the issue is, it will be all facing that way. We should probably, for all intents and purposes, have it so it's facing the same direction, right? Let's apply it. And, um... Oh, is this... Okay, let's actually... Let's think about this before I go any further. Let's, uh, have all this rendered, right? So... Let's change this color because this would definitely be uh the metal. The metal. And this is probably going to be whatever the mat is. So we can reuse these uh textures. And let's shift shifty. Uh, do I want Y? I don't is that the way we want it? I uh, yeah, I, th I think that would just work better. Fifty. Boom. Okay, it's pretty. It's mid. I'll be honest. It's mid. But it but it works. That's the best part. But it works. Should just now. Uh no. And if we just move all these down, uh, we'll probably go on the middle. The heck? That's interesting. Okay, yeah, let's instead, let's just do the faces and bring this down. What's it, what would this look like? Yeah. Bring everything down at once. Um, uh, yeah, it'll be fine. Considering I can't see what it looks like, it will be most certainly fine. Um, what would do for all intents and purposes? Yeah, just move it down just a little bit. And we'll just join them. Okay, it's not perfect. It most certainly looks decent. Okay. Okay, so now let's, uh, now let's edit this piece of crap, the, uh, the arm. The arm is definitely going to be another big attention to detail we need here. Um, oh yeah, so, we should probably just, uh, yeah, let's have it extruding over, so we might just have to, like, move the top and bottom down a little bit. Let's extrude this up. And what we'll do is... Let's just make everything slightly bigger. Um, yeah, that would just make sense. Make it slightly bigger. And uh, let's extrude this way. And this way. It'll be fine. And let's move both of these out. Up and out. 
for right here. Oh, shoot. Yeah, okay. Oh, uh, let's have a... I really don't want to make this any like, bigger. I want to have as least amount of polygons as possible. So let's move this up. And yeah, this looks interesting. Not amazing, but it definitely looks interesting. This works too. Um. Let's move the top up just a little bit. And let's hit it with one of these. Uh, hmm, I like it. I just don't love it. So the issue is it runs in the there. So <sighs> hmm. I mean it's a chair, it's hopefully it should look a little better than this. One of those gamer chairs, bro. Like gamer. Uh the back a little. We'd have to see what it looks like uh, in action. Let me move this uh, top part down a little bit. It's up a little bit. Yeah, I mean, I could see it. I don't think it's spectacular, but I definitely think it's Oh, that, that's this way. I think right there is a little fat in comparison to the rest of it. So what we'll do is just make it a little skinnier. Yep, and I could probably try to make this bigger. Top part. Okay, so what we're gonna have to do. Oof. What happens if we scale it? It works. Not amazing, but it most certainly does work. And. So this whole part on top. Okay, let's. Let's add some colors to this, alright? So. So majority of it's just gonna be silver. The silver, right? Pretty basic, pretty pretty nothing special. Now let's get the top and we'll uh obviously the front. Let's add a new one and change it to the black. So it also looks like the whole thing, the same kind of black, which I'll give them consistency. Man. Okay. Um, let's not add it yet. Because see how like tight the chair just looks? Maybe we need to make the chair a little thicker. Yeah. I'm not saying they're thick. What I'm saying is I think they just need a little extra support somewhere. And boom. Beautiful. Absolutely phenomenal. Let 
boys are almost there actually so if one of the chairs we can put up the finishing touches on the chair so what i'll end up doing um the chair looks fine what i'm gonna have to do is we can keep the chair like this but i'm gonna need to make a cut along the bottom here so we can connect the one part to the other part and uh I'm gonna go delete the faces off of this bad boy. Let's just join them at this point. Easier to work on. Um, and let's face. Cool. And not awful, actually. Not awful. Yeah, there we go. You obviously need the headrest on the top. Um, yeah, this is definitely looking pretty fire, I must say. I almost forgot down here. We need to connect. We need to connect this. Oh, this would be an utter pain to do, though. Without it looking like horrendous. I mean, it'll be fine. No clue what it looks like, but it will it'll be fine. I promise, guys. Let me check the faces. Yep. Pretty standard, pretty good. So, so far, what we've accomplished so far is building this uh table and chair. It seems I might need to make the table a little taller. Maybe the chair is too tall. I don't know. It's all about perspective. And, uh, honestly, I think... What up? Wait, is, uh, is this still... Oh, yeah, it's just not connected. So I do a little bit of a stretchy stretch. And, yeah, we'll just mess it up a little bit. Make a flush with everything else. Yeah. Oh yeah. We are looking fire. Um, let's hide the arm. Let's just work on the base. So. So what it looks like. Um. Okay. Oof, this is gonna be a pain, guys. So I think it's divided in separate, like separate. Looks like it'd be like a back and a middle. I'm not sure exactly how. But why? Why is this side? It just move it. That seems about right. Not quite a hundred percent right, but hmm. I wonder. So what it looks like there's like an indentation in the middle and everything kinda pops up. So, what we're gonna do, let's do, and we're gonna need a, one for the head. Yeah, it's, we're like quick, quick, make this as quick as possible. Oh, this. Oh, Jesus. That's awful. Maybe we should extrude it and do that. Unextrude look, and then if we did that. Oh, it's 
kind of bad. Hmm. What we could do is... Yeah, like, I wonder if we move it forward, will it look any better? Uh, kinda woody, yeah. It would look a little better. Let's instead do... You know what, let's, let's see what we can get done with it. I feel like if we do it to all of it, we have to get some decent result. Decent. All the spots that matter, at least. So let's select it. Um. <sighs> These chairs could be so like dummy thick. Also, doing it. To the I don't think we'd need to do it to the side. And let's instead do that. Let's scale it. Oh, that's absolutely terrifically awful. Um, yeah, I like this. And everything in the middle, let's just move up. Um, maybe like the bottom is not what we need to do. Let me, let me see how the top would look. I think this looks more fluffy than that. So I'm not quite sure what I want to do here. I could just leave it like this, but... <sighs> hmm. Maybe you can manually manually just mess with it. Which I think which is what we just end up doing. About right, uh we'll probably move down the face here a little bit. Let me actually put one here, we'll put one here. As long as we have less, like, faces overall, I think it will be fine. Looks like it's, like, rotated inwards, too. Let me... Let me, let me take, let me backtrack a little. Now let's move these two up just a tad bit. Uh, yeah, that seems about right. Cool. Okay, um... Hmm. Okay. Let's let's do one side at a time. We can we can mirror X, right? Yeah, we should be able to mirror X, right? Not here though. So why don't I just get the big brain idea where I can actually just mirror? Put a mirror on it. And let's just uh eat ha like half the X. That seems about right. Cool. Now I can do pretty much anything. Without it really mattering. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
gosh. Maybe I need might need to taper that one in a little bit, but I'm not sure. The bottom end. Or do I want to move it backwards? Move the front one forwards a little bit. Take the side. Clean this up just a tad bit. Um, and bringing the top. Let me see, how would uh, this look? Yeah, no, we're gonna have to. Okay, um. Before we continue with this, let me also bevel the side. Let's bevel, uh. Even beveling just seems off now. Let's just put a, like, a clear cut through the side. And let's move. Let's move it. And, uh, up here too. Okay, yeah, this is definitely looking more like a chair. Looks like a chair. Um. Ah, oh, shoot. Let me... <clears throat> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to do like a, a three cut, which I don't want to do because of... Apology, but... She's fine, alright. Oh, uh, should be on the side then. Just varying it in. We'll just have a little bit and make it come in a little bit. Yep. Looks pretty decent. Let me put it, uh, let me look at it. Um, yeah, I, I, I think. Let me smooth it out. Um. Point, I, I think it'll be fine. Smooth, smooth. Looks about fine. And let's add the microphone and let's let's add all this together. And join. After I apply this. We also should probably set a color for this part. Oh, we want it to be at the matte color, so... Even though right now it looks shinier, it will change during, uh... It goes in Audio Legend. <sighs> Let me check, uh, face orientation. Good enough for me. How it looks. It doesn't matter if I do another one either because it doesn't really matter. As long as it's a. Uh... It's the same chair, hopefully. So it should be. Should be fine, right? Let's do the mic whole microphone thing. Actually, it looks... Let me move up the table a little bit. Because the arm of the chair looks flush. To here. And what we'll do is we'll take the bottom, get all of it, and we'll fi fix it up a little.
Okay. Yeah. Seems about right now. Ah, yes. So now we need to do the microphone. Tripod plus the microphone, alright? Which should be pretty simple. Honestly, it's not going to be anything spectacular. We're just going to add... Looks like it's the metal color, not the mat. So, whatever, right? So let's just get everything set up. Pop it over here. And let's just get this all smaller. And let's, uh, it looks, just based off of looks alone, that there is a cylinder. So we're going to connect this to the cylinder. Let's get a circle. No, oh, uh, cylinder. And, um, scale it down a bit. Let's rotate it. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's make it a tad bit smaller. My tab, it's gonna be a lot smaller. So I'm not quite sure what this is. It looks like it's something to adjust the microphone. I'm not quite sure. So we're gonna keep it. But the only issue is, am I able? To, am I able to delete any faces? I am able to delete this face right here. No, just one. One, uh. Actually, no, I'm gonna undo that. Because we might want it for another one, considering it repeats itself. Cool. <clears throat> and let's. Pick a square. Oh, that's a blade. Hey, man. Um. Cube. Cubing it up. Um, makes it like super huge. I could go straight up for now. And let's make it a little thin. Oh, God. So how high would I say? It's a little above chair height. So let me take it from up here to the maxes. And let's it's definitely bring it down a couple notches. Like, oh god. Let's bring it down all the way about right. That's it right here would be probably perfect. Shift D. And um, it's about the same size. Rotate it a little bit. Rotate. 
And let's move it a little bit. Mm. Yep. That's about right. Two, two ones similar to this, but super small. Super duper small. Okay. Um, 50. Uh, let's uh, just... It's like in all the, uh, directions, it's smaller in length. It's about half size as well. And let's go about uh, does it say X? I'll just keep on going down. Oh yeah, that's it right there. So let's and let's just do this and divide it by two. Um, maybe that's a little too small per se, right? And let's do a. Fifty. And let's join them for simplicity. They're literally just two squares. That's all they are. Just two squares. Um, a little down. A little bit right here. Move this up. Oh, okay. Let's put it in. Cool. Pretty, pretty basic. Okay, so now it looks like that, that's more of a triangle. But we could literally just use this again. Best part is we could just use it again, you know? Oh, gosh. Oh, man. Oh. I'm tired. And let me put this down here. Now let's a little bit. Take it over here a bit. And so for all sake of purposes, let's make it a little skinnier. Oh uh, no. I'll do this instead. I'll do this to both sides. There's no Yeah, I don't know why it's doing that. Let me Yeah, it's only to like hmm. I guess I will make it smaller and just manually move one side in a little bit. Uh, yeah, this works. And let's move these. These four. Let's just move it out a little bit. And this one will out a little more too. Might as well. Eh, about right. And then we can... Get the microphone to move. I'm gonna have to make two separate ones just because before we join them, they have to be a, a certain way. I, I think so, at least. So let's get a, uh, in. We can't get a. That's gonna matter. Uh, size. Uh, how, what? Did a get a 
cylinder and have five sides. It's very, um, very, it's going to be very small, so it should be fine. No one's going to notice. It only has five sides. And uh, let's move it over here. Move it up here. And boom. And from that is connected directly with the aft of the mic. Can't really tell. I think it is to the aft. Doesn't really matter. I don't think so, at least. Let me... Dude, I just got a shirt pain, bro. That hurt. That actually hurt. Uh, whatever. I'm still breathing. Ooh, that, that's weird. I don't know why I won't let me make it smaller. Unless if I just literally just make it smaller like this. Which is whatever, I guess. Um, move it up like, and like so. Now it's connected. Wow, I'm such like a, a genius. Let's just move it out. From here, uh, let me make it look a little nicer. It's a little jank. like leaning to the it's weirdly leaning it's good enough for me um. <sighs> shoot okay so what we're gonna do <clears throat> now we're gonna work on the microphone Uh, and from there, we're just gonna add. We're gonna like manually add it to the um, side of it. I don't know how else I could really do that. I think the top of it is gonna need to be a different. Top of it's gonna be its own material too. I cool. and let me get a cylinder. We'll probably want 16 on this one, at least. Yeah. Give the microphone a little more detail. And make it a little smaller, and boom, we have the microphone. Well, kind of. Let's move it to right here. Let's give it a good old rotate. Go rotate it over here. And, um, cool. Scale it down a bit. Okay, now, now we're talking. So what we're gonna have to do is, um, I'm going to edit the bottom of this, and push it in. Oh gosh, um. Fact of the matter is, the reason now that it's sideways. Yeah. Hmm. What we can do is we can just hit it with one of these and this should work. Yep. And do this. And now that we have that, we can just literally scale this up. Yeah. Uh, now it's going to be the pain in moving this. Actually looks somewhat decent. 
Uh, it's not completely on correctly, but it should be decent enough to where it shouldn't matter. And what does it look like when when this is smoothed? Yeah, about right. And then we we have the same shape on top, but it's flipped upside down and stubbier. Yeah. So all we're gonna do is rotate it. Just uh, and um, yeah, that's gonna be the issue. We're gonna have to only rotate it this way. This is the best I could get it. So we're gonna need to make it like chonky, like that works. And um Yeah, this is actually coming out better than I expected. Yeah, let's push this in up up a little bit. Uh, push this over, push this down. Push this about right here, and you know what? I'm okay with this. So now, boom. Gosh. Um. Now it's time for touch-ups. Let's touch it up by, uh... Man, I really want to make, like, this... You know what? Easy, easy solution. Boom, and... Boom. That's my only concern with this. Um, let's just change this whole color into having its own color. Let's uh, give it... For all intents and purposes, we're going to leave it as white. And for all intents and purposes, we'll change it in the... Um, we'll change it in Unreal Engine. And we'll use this color. Oh, I have to do one at a time. That's fantastic. But I could just... Let's smooth it out. Maybe make everything look a little nice and fancy. Make everything look fancy. Keyword. Look. And this is supposed to be like a reflective black, so... That's uh, that's the in all intents and purposes of it. Cool. Use this, what is it? Uh, vortex groups. It's not an auto smooth, right? So we do all this, can we do... See, it doesn't really work, I don't think. See, I don't know what it's smoothing, which is not it. Face maps, UV maps. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to just click on them individually. Just save me time and effort, I'm just gonna shade everything smooth then. Yeah, see? No, no if I do it this way, it works. And then, uh, duplicate all this and move it to the side. As much as I do it, wish I could just copy and paste, I know I'm not going to be able to. Uh, yeah. Um, I 
actually move this a little bit. And duplicate it. Come on, like right here. And from here, I let's just rotate everything right here. Uh, yeah, I'll be fine. And except we're gonna rotate this separately. Uh, yeah, that that this should work. Let's just move it on. Yeah, that should be good enough. <sighs> and let's put all this into as in one object. Join. Join. Cool. We have effectively made the setup. So, um, I need to think about what I want to do here. Uh, let's let's see how everything uh, loads in. Um, let's also scale it down a little bit. Because I honestly don't know what uh, what else I'd probably use the microphone for. I don't think I'll use it for anything, to be honest. In comparison to everything else. Uh, and let's uh, export this bad boy. Uh, there we go. Cool. Uh, let's do... Oh shoot, I should probably have saved this first. Why does it always want to save under people? I'm so weird. Pod. Let's export it again under it. And this time let's remember to do this. Let's drag and drop and see what it looks like. Okay, let's go to my objects and we're just gonna uh, make a folder for this. Might as well, right? And we're just gonna name it like this. So I know where everything's at. And uh, let's go through here real quick. Uh, do -do -do. Dude, is it, the more I don't actually like organize this, the worse it gets to navigate. It's so bad. Uh, uh yeah, support all. Oh shoot! You know what we forgot to do? We forgot to make the uh, studio light. Uh, should I spend that much attention to detail? I mean, I really don't think it matters. But I think it would be like a nice touch. Let's um, let's see how everything looks in Unreal Engine first. Okay, so it's about about the size we want. Very decent. Uh, we need to definitely change the materials in here, but that's. Yeah, it's definitely looking. Okay, yeah, let, let's 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 add the one thing so we can do pay attention to detail here. Cool. Let's delete it and we'll just re-import it. Cool. So let's add one last key feature, which shouldn't take us too long. 
actually going to take a note off of what we did here. So we're just going to actually kind of wing it. I'm not even going to cap. We're just going to kind of, oh, I'm sorry. We're good. just going to wing it. So what we're going to do is let's start with the good old toys. So it'll definitely be like the studio light. And me knowing we could have like, should I make it so it's only one side and have like another one and just make it super flat? We're going to do that. Let's, uh, boom, faces. And what we're going to want to do is just make an, actually, no, I think it would just be smarter to make another one before we do that. So we can make one the same size. And what we can do is now do this. Delete half the faces. And let's flatten this bad boy out. Oh, crap. I could just do this. But let's also make it smoother. Let's also make it a little smaller here. Uh, let me use the smooth tool. Yep, and let me see how this looks. Absolutely phenomenal. You know what I'll just do is just add like a stick on it. I, I, I mean, it's not gonna be anything grandiose. This is gonna just add a stick. I mean, <laughs> nothing special. So let's um, let's first. I'm gonna make this like a yellow. These other things would be changed in the and shouldn't really matter at this point. Yellow. And this, we're gonna actually continue with the metal aesthetic. So, so I can remember. Let's join. Actually, for all intents and purposes, for performance, I'm going to. Going to remove uh, crap. I don't actually want to do I want to have it solid, but I want to be able to see through. Cool. Yep, that's what we want. And we're going to which one are we selecting? We we'll select select the back of it. That's what we want. Uh, we want to be able to select Yeah, we keep wanting, keep selecting through, and we do not want to select through. Um, dude, this would be a pain. I really, you know what? I have an idea. Yep, there we go. We're making progress. We're making progress. Quite what we wanted. Not quite what we want. Keep selecting that. We're having a hard time. Dude. Am I just like stupid or like. Oh yeah, we're also stupid because this is also a lot of. Ugh, crap. Hold up. We need to figure this out before. I mean, I can also try to smooth this. I should probably do that. Smooth. And uh, should I just make it bigger? Uh, I think so, yeah. Jeez, oh, let me, f dude, I don't know what I can do here. I didn't think this would have been the difficult part. Let's just actually, um, let's uh, make this a bit smaller, shall we? I thought honestly could be able to just, uh, 
There we go. I do not. Oh my gosh. I'm just trying to get the sides of it, man. It just doesn't want me to get the sides. Yeah. Um. Let me switch over to this and. this and I really don't want to like half of me just wants to see yeah screw it I don't care but for quality assurance okay so why why is it when I want to it on the one side it just automatically does it to the other okay well screw it a little a little extra triangles it hasn't killed any game I don't think let's join it And beautiful. Probably like this part of it doesn't need to be so bright. Big but actually. Let's do this. Alright. Let's move it down. Yep. And let's add a stick. Uh, actually, I think we could have just got a smaller one. Let's just do that. Uh, mesh. Uh, let's just go with eight. Something like won't be too noticeable, but. Uh, definitely, definitely small enough for it not to really affect it. And let's just move. Pretty decent, pretty decent. Um, considering I do not know what a... Let's, uh... Doesn't really matter, just delete the face. And let's just get a circle. A sphere. Absolutely amazing, All right? Wrong way, and let's... Let's only cut... Cut from here down. Complete faces. And boom. Move. Let's, considering I did it so early, we are really gonna need to like get all this and just move it down. And switch over here. And now we just add it. Join, and oh, let me actually make this part smaller before we do that. Oh god. Scale. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need to make it smaller. Definitely. Let's add this. Just move this down. Just a little bit. Join. Oh boy. 
Okay, let me set reset the new world position and then we can finish up this and just re 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 reinforce all of it. Uh let's add this here for now and join. Cool. Let's save it. Let's re export it. Well, let me double check. Let's drag and drop in Unreal Engine. And cool. Ooh. Decent enough. Yeah, I. Hello to whoever joined me. Right now, just working on Easter egg room. And let's see how everything looks in here. Relatively decent, actually. Okay, cool. Now let's let's do this. Let me look up. Let me look at this real quick. Go back to here. Clicking so quickly without. And let me open this bad boy up. We're gonna probably have to change the color. Um, because it's probably a, we're doing like a studio light. Yeah. Just drag and put it on here. Get rid of this. Ooh, okay. Okay. It's a little, I mean, it's bright. Let me knock it down by like that's a 20. Um, and I'll, instead of just making a uh, blueprint, considering this is only going to be used one, just in case if I happen to want to use it somewhere else, let's do, uh, hey, yo. How are you doing? How are you doing, Melvin? Let's do a light and EP. And let me open that baby up and let's. Hey, yo, you... hey, listen, I proudly wear that face. Never play Fallout 76, man. Don't disrespect that face. That's all I gotta say. Static mesh. God. Oh, where is it? Um, is it over here? Eddie, uh... E, let's go. Let's put this here. How bright is it? Uh, does it need to be brighter? Oh, it would help if I had the thing in the level, wouldn't it? Oh man, I'm just saying, next up, did you find this? Props to you. It, this is well hidden. Well hidden. Uh, we'll go with it. So people can appreciate this. I'm just going to leave the colors over here. This over here. Or like an accurate representation of the room. Plus, I just think the lighting looks better if it's over here. And, um, let me actually open up the cone. Should I have an inner cone? Ooh. And we move all this bullshit up. Uh, how do you think? Does this look like an accurate representation of a certain uh, podcast room? 
I just have to change up uh, the colors on the stuff, and it should be should be pretty close. Um, if I remember, that's a black metal. So let's change this to a black, completely black. Uh, add a little. Let's add a constant. Let's set it to 20. That's a little rough. Oh, fuck. Let's, let's do 10. Let's do 10. How was zero? I forgot. It's only between one and zero and one. So let's do 19. Let's apply and see how all the metal looks. That looks pretty decent. Looks a little too shiny. I should also make it a little gray. And make it like. Give it a normal, and this should be pretty much good to go. We do not want a multiplier. What's it? Metallic. Metallic's what we wanted. To get one is not shiny, correct? On metallic. How much it goes at? Zero point. Uh, zero point seven. We should be fine. Um, yeah, now that looks more like a metal. And set this to like a matte black. So like a slight shine. Um, so let's do like a zero point. Uh, that, that is not what we want. It's bad. Roughness. Can I get any, uh... The issue is it, it just looks the same. That looks shinier. I think that's it. We just need to make it darker. That's not gonna do... That's not gonna do it. Okay, we need, uh... Find. Let's just look through materials. We need, we need to give it a normal. And the issue is, I don't know what I can add. There's a little bit of texturing. Definitely give us a good amount of crap. So I'm scrolling through. And make it look like a no. It looks so weird. Actually, do I have a normal on this? I do not. Okay, cool. Let's keep looking through. Uh, what about this metal? This metal definitely has a. Yep. Just copy and paste on that. And. Uh, I think I did it for the right one. Uh, maybe it's a little strong. It is. Okay. Um. I really don't want to make it more, look more metallic, but issue was just. It's just simply not black enough. That that's definitely an issue. It's just simply not black enough. Um, it's definitely the um. I'm 
trying to think what what could I do because now it's it's not simply just like the texturing looking at a reference you know what we'll make it more uh, metal looking What I mean by that is I'm just going to make it more like this. Because we know that said like a difference. And I think this can work. I need to maybe make it a little more shiny. Give like a leather kind of look to it. I mean, yeah, that might be a little too much. And, yeah, I mean, it seems about right. Uh, change this color to literally just be black. And, should also work. What if I have no, like, still has a shine, so I'm going to have to make it, like, Let's have two constants of zero and see what they both are rough in the metallic. There should be one. Oh, bro, that is that is what we call black. It's dark. It's like a void. It's like a void. Oh, where, where is it? Where, where did it go? Let me just type it in. Pod. Cool. Um. Truly is a void. Yeah, um. I think I know what we can do. Literally make it such so it's as though it's as it's a void. And that it should actually. Ooh, yes. Looking spicy. Yeah, boom. So now we have the setup. This is actually. Oh god, why is it so aggy? I'll uh, actually build the lighting in this area. Why do that? Honestly, I feel like for the hour and 40 minutes we've put into just like the setup alone, I think we've got a relatively decent result. Relatively decent. Um, I don't know how long this is going to take this to see like the full effect of the lighting. But uh, let me see, let me close this out so we can get, get this done a lot quicker. Save, yep. But yeah, so... Uh, this, this is going to be hidden in an area. Pretty neat. Uh, what, what, do you, what is your opinion on this? Any, uh... Is it good? Is it good? Bad? What's the good, bad, and the ugly? I think this is pretty sweet. I, I like the glow on that, but I think everything else is pretty, uh, pretty decent. I mean, for like a sh short time putting effort in. A little Easter egg room. It's pretty tight. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, cool. Oh, right, no, it's loading. Oh boy. So we have a weird, like, a weird lighting thing here. That's odd. Hmm. It still looks sick as fuck, though. Um. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the podcast. Not the podcast. 
the stream. The stream of making the setup for a podcast. <laughs> so funny. Um. Yeah. Um. Sorry, I I lost my train of thought. Hope you enjoyed the stream. I'll be streaming tomorrow, same time. With that. Catch you guys in the next stream. Juice.